Okay, well, okay, so here we're in the general case study one, solving absolute value equation. Definition, absolute value x equals x, such that x is greater than equal to zero, and negative x, such that x is less than equal to zero. Solving absolute value equations by graphing steps. Step one, graph the right side. Step two, graph the left side. Step three, find the x values of the intersection. Types of absolute value equation solutions. One solution intersects once, two solutions they intersect twice, and no solution they do not intersect at all. Solving absolute value equations algebraically step. Step one, isolate the absolute value. Step two, apply the definition absolute value of x equals positive number and absolute of x equals a negative number. Step three, solve for x. Okay, go ahead and finish up the notes from the first page. All right, let's take a look at example number one. Solve the absolute value equation. Okay, so we're going to graph the left side. And let's do the left side in yellow. Okay. All right. Now, the minus four means we go right four up two. So right one, two, three, four up two. Okay. Now, since there's no transformation in front or in front of the x, we know we can just go to the right one, up one, to the left one, up one, to the left one, up one, to the right one, up one. Okay. And let's do the right side in green. So that's y equals 2. Okay, so your x value point of intersection is your solution. So the x value is 1, 2, 3, 4. So the point of intersection is 4, 2. So that means our solution is x equals 4. Okay, go ahead and finish up example number one. All right, example number two. So that means we go left four, down two. So we go left one, two, three, four, down two. And then from the vertex, we know we go right one, up one, right one, up one, right one, up one. And go all the way. And then here we go, left one, up one, left one, up one. Okay, and then let's go ahead and graph the right side in green. And that's a horizontal line at two. Okay. So our point of intersection, by the way, was this point right here. So our points of intersection are right here and right here. So that point is negative one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two. So eight comma two and this is zero comma two so our solutions are x equals oh i'm sorry that's negative eight comma two and zero comma two so our solutions are x equals negative eight and x equals zero Okay, go ahead and finish up example two. All right, let's take a look at example three. Okay, so this means we go left four, up five. So left one, two, three, four, up one, two, three, four, five. And then since there's no 
transformation in front of the X or in front, we can just go right one up one, right one up one, left one up one, left one up one. Okay. And we have a horizontal line at two. So since they don't intersect, there is no solution. Okay. Go ahead and finish up example three, start working on your assignment, and have a wonderful Wildcat day.